Hi guys, Dominate Fishing, I'm Dan Meyer, and in today's short video, we're gonna be talking about mistakes that people make when they're crappie fishing that are costing them fish and preventing them from catching a bunch of crappies. So the first big mistake that a lot of people make when they're going out to catch crappies is that they classify them with other panfish. They think, okay, we're going pan fishing, that means we fish the back of a bay, we fish the shoreline, we fish in shallow water in the weeds. And doing that, you might catch some bluegills, you might catch some perch, you might catch some rock bass, you even might catch some small crappies, but you're not going to catch the crappies that you're looking for. You're not going to catch the nice crappies um, that, that are good for taking home and eating for dinner. Crappies... When it, in the spring, you can catch them in the shallow, but when it comes to fishing crappies in the summer, they're going to move out and they're going to be in deeper water. They're going to suspend out in deeper water during the day, and then they're going to move into the deep weeds to feed at night and in the morning and evening. So if you fish for crappies in the shallows in the summer, you're probably not going to get any, and if you do, they're going to be small ones. The second mistake that crappie fishermen make is they fish them during the day. Now, because again, when you're thinking pan fish, you're thinking, oh, you can catch them all day. Crappies are low light feeders. So the best time to catch them is right before dark and very early in the morning. Now, this is not to say that you can't catch them during the day. You could go out into deeper water and find them and catch them during the day. But usually what's going to happen is you're going to pick up one here, one there. And then if you get down to those twilight hours, maybe two hours before dark, you'll catch more fish in that short span than you did all day. So your best bet to catch crappies in the summer is to fish the prime time, which is right before dark or early in the morning. And the third, I would say, of the biggest mistakes that crappie fishermen make is they use the wrong bait. And again, when you're thinking of pan fishing, uh, a lot of people like to use worms and night crawlers. Those are panfish baits, right? And again, those will catch bluegills, those will catch perch, they'll catch bass, they'll catch walleyes. Crappies don't really like night crawlers. Now that's not to say you'll pick up you won't pick up one here and there because you will occasionally catch a crappie on a night crawler, but crappies on average don't feed on night crawlers. They'll just watch them fall to the bottom. You got to use different baits for crappies, minnows, leeches, uh, stuff like that. Now, if you want to see my top baits for catching crappies, if you're concerned you're not using the right baits, you want to know the top baits for catching crappies, I've put together my top five baits in a PDF, and I will give it to you. It's free. I'll email it to you. All you have to do is click on the link or follow the link in the description of this video right at the top. Um, enter your details and I will email you my top five baits for catching crappies. These are crappie killers. I've already caught hundreds of crappies on them this year um, and I know they'll work well for you. So just uh, click on the link, enter your details. Just, just know you're going to have to enter them twice because I want to make sure that you're a real person who wants this PDF. Um, and not some computer generated robot. So click on the link or follow the link and enter your details. I will email you my top baits for catching crappies. And again, these are crappie killers. So I hope this video helps you. I hope it helps you avoid some of the mistakes a lot of people make when they're trying to catch crappies in the summer. You can go out, fish the prime time, fish the deep weeds, use the right baits, and catch crappies this summer. So if this video helped you, hit the thumbs up or the like button. Also, if this is your first time here, I'd love to have you subscribe to my YouTube channel. I do videos just like this to help you catch more and bigger fish. So like, subscribe, get a copy of my top baits, and I'll see you next time.